Ladies and gentlemen, this evening's next bout features in the blue corner a senior from Elmhurst, Illinois and Soren College, Nick Bronco Bortolotti. And in the gold corner, his opponent, a sophomore from La Jolla, California, and O'Neill Hall, Will the Thrill Peterson. There you get a good look at the sophomore from California, Will Peterson. And uh, if you can hear it, and if it isn't evident, the, the screams of Bronco ringing through this one. 142. Underway, Peterson, Bortolotti. Peterson comes out with two quick jabs. Bortolotti is a bruiser. Something we always see from Peterson is he is really quick. Watch the jabs. There was a quick one there. We're going to see that a lot. And he's a southpaw, so that could possibly throw off Bortolotti. Bortolotti pushing, pushing, pushing so far. The aggressive one here as they go to the clinch. And this one early. Bam, bam, big. Good combination here early from Bordelotti. They go back to the clinch. And these two fighters, excuse me, boxers, these two boxers are lightning quick. And the yells of Bronco getting quick here in this one. Good head movement here from Peterson. Looking to spin away here from Bordelotti's bombs. Back to the clinch, breaking it up here. Left hooks from Bortolotti. Uppercut misses right there from the right hand. Nice, nice counter jab here from Peterson. And you can hear Bortolotti's ring man yelling, set it up with the jab. When you set up those combinations with the jab, it's always the second punch that is usually the most dangerous. It's usually the best aimed and has the most power. And you see Bortolotti setting up that 1-3 combination, looking for the jab with the, the quick hook. And that was a good jab there by Bortolotti. Keep Peterson at bay here. Bortolotti, the aggressive so far in this one. The captain from Illinois, Sword College, the senior. Peterson poking around with that counter jab, and that was another fantastic first round. I Almost too close to call. You got to think the slight edge might have went to Bordelotti. I think so. I think you're right about that, Ryan. It was definitely close. I think for the first half of that first round, so to speak, Will Will Peterson did a great job, especially with his left hand and some combination punches. But I think Bordelotti turned that around, kind of controlled him with the jab, kept him at bay a little bit, and Peterson got a little bit off his game. So he's going to have to respond from this one. Hopefully his corner's telling him, you know, maybe dodge a few more punches. Defense got to pick up just a little bit. But overall, definitely an even round, but I would score for Bordelotti. Look at how they got here. Bordelotti knocked off Nick Bowick there in the semifinals. Will Peterson, the unanimous decision over John Garvin just a few nights ago here at the Joyce. This is the second of 11 championship bouts tonight. 142, Bordelotti, Peterson gearing up for round two road goes here. Thanks for joining us here on UMD.com, 82nd Annual Bingo Bouts Championship, bout number two, round two. And these two men pick up where they left off, trading blows. Good job there. Looks like the counter hook found the place there for Peterson. Bordelotti coming out with those strong, quick one-two combinations. Bordelotti. Sticking one right there on Peterson's chin, the aggressor. Good job, though, by Peterson, continuing to counter punch, looking to land the blow there. A lot of blows landed there for Bordelotti and that flurry. Something Peterson was doing early on that he's not doing quite as well now is good footwork. You'll see that he's spreading his feet a little bit too much. There he had good balance there, but when he throws a punch, he's not keeping him under himself, and that's where Bordelotti's been taking advantage. First, that boxing stance, you want to keep your body real tight. All about balance, shoulders right above the knees, level hips, heels slightly off the floor. Good observation there, Ronnie. And Bordelotti starting to pour it on. As Peterson falls back into his defense. They're going to 
Look at the standing eight count here to Will the Thrill Peterson. The senior captain, Nick Bronco Bordelotti. Out of the blue corner, Peterson gets the standing eight count. Let's go, play here, they touch gloves. Peterson, again here, you said it looks like Peterson's stance might have gotten a little wide here. Big bomb there from Peterson, though. Bordelotti standing his ground. Good head move, though, by Peterson. Bordelotti to Blanco, remaining the aggressor in this one. With one, two combinations, and there's a fantastic counter jab from the throw Peterson. And that's got to give Peterson some motivation. He needs to feed off of that and get right back into this. Looking for those counter punches, those openings, those opportunities for Peterson. Bordelotti clearly the aggressor in this one. Round two is going to come to a close. Peterson gets the standing eight count. you got to think the judges are going to score that one for Bordelotti. Uh, certainly. I, I think that one goes to Bordelotti. I think he's got the edge right now. Peterson certainly is still in this one. So if he can win himself the third round, since the first round was such a toss-up, that's definitely a viable option. He still couldn't possibly win this bout. See a few replays here. Both boxers, heavy gloves. Throwing blows. Get a good look here at Bronco Bordelotti getting Peterson against the ropes. Peterson, only a sophomore, so no matter the outcome of this one, you got to think that the future is bright for the thrill from O'Neill Hall. And he's certainly a great talent because he made it to the finals last year. He's a runner-up from last year, so I'm certain that we will see him again next year and most likely the year after that. But one thing I did notice is he's looking a little bit more tired than Bordelotti. He's got to come out strong here. Boxers touch gloves. Round three underway. Peterson, Bordelotti. Bordelotti, big left hook here to open this one up. Peterson continuing to jab through his way out, and here comes a big combination from Bordelotti. Peterson ducking, moving. Bordelotti, the aggressor in this one. Peterson continuing to land some fantastic counter punches. Great head movement here from the sophomore. And this is the best that he's looked since the beginning of the first round with those counter punches. Better defense from Peterson. Got to think that counter hook caught Bordelotti a little off guard. Another counter hook lands for Peterson. Peterson in the goal. Yeah, now Peterson seems to be the aggressor. He stunned him a little bit there with that one counter. Peterson backs him into a corner. Bordelotti moves his way out of it. Great defense here from Will Peterson. Peterson loading up that left hand, looking for the hook. Good combination there. One, two, jab, hooks. You hear Broncos, big man yelling out one, two, three, looking for that jab, cross, hook combination. Peterson making up some ground here in the third round. His pitch landing there. Good combination for the sophomore. Peterson loading up that left hand, looking to land that second punch in the combination. Good counter jabs, good defense, and Peterson controlling this one. What an effort here. Two men just slugging it out. You can see the exhaustion and the fatigue starting to set in for both men. Who's going to hold it out in the final bell rings? When the two men lead each other at midcourt, what a war here. Fantastic effort from our two boxers. It was another great bout, not surprising at all because we saw great performances from these two in the semis, and, and you knew they would match up well in this particular bout, and I think it's going to come down to possibly another split decision, but maybe I think Bordelotti's going to win it because I think he possibly took the first two rounds. Nick Bronco Bordelotti, the senior from Elmhurst, Illinois, and Soren College in the blue. Captain here. And it's the sophomore in the gold corner, Will the Thrill Peterson from La Jolla, California, and O'Neill Hall. So we get a 
another look here. Both men landing a lot of blows. And you see Peterson there getting behind the crowd. Another fantastic contest here at 142. Judges, the five judges taking their time in this one. We will go to JT in the ring here for the score here between Peterson and Bordelotti. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner in the 142 pound weight division by split decision. The winner in the blue corner, Nick Bronco Bortolotti. So the senior captain gets another trophy. It's Nick Bronco Bortolotti in the split decision over Will the Thrill Peterson.